Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna show you how we can abstract with acrylic, but this time someone requests if I can try less feminine colors. So let's get started. So I just use my charcoal, right? And I just wet in the charcoal so when I blend it with the colors, it doesn't get too muddy so it dries faster. Alright, so I'm gonna use very neutral colors today. I'm gonna have like black, gray, different kind of gray, maybe a little bit of like green here and there. So let's make this abstract just playing around. I'm gonna get some white over here. Again, okay, remember, this is a work in process. Nothing is done on sending stone today or on this video. We will always come, I will always come back and pay more and do more stuff to the painting, okay? Of this blue in here, just because I like blue. Black. My palette knife, and I just gonna do scratches and play around with this now. Right, so now I just switch to the squeaker, and you can see I have paint on the border. And I just gonna come this way and pull down slowly. Slowly, you don't have to rush, slow. And then I'm gonna get the white. And I'm gonna put it over here. And I'm gonna come this way, and then I might do it all over again. And now I'm gonna wet my palette. And then I'm gonna come this way, screen down. This way, screen down. And screen down. I'm gonna come up here and do pretty much the same. We are making layers, remember, layers after layers. There is not a plan. Nothing is set on stone either. Okay, you can do marks however you want. Let's put this little green guy behind, thank you. And then after I do this, I'm gonna put more white and different colors, okay? So right now, I'm liking what's happening. It's like giving me a sensation of uh, something very chaotic, but uh, it's gonna get body as soon as we keep incorporating more colors, okay? And what I mean by that is the same colors, just different tones, okay? All right, let's finish this part over here. Okay, let's try to put that up here. Alright, so now that we got the cover with the squeaker, I like to use the leftover on the brush and take it away from here now, as well. I'm going to work with the green a little bit more up here and I'm going to use more white. More white. Okay. I'm not pressing my I'm not pressing the brush too hard when I incorporate in my white. I like to leave like those little crispy, like texture kind of thing, right? The texture part. And that's, I love that very much. All right, so now what I'm doing is I'm working on areas that I enjoy one at a time. You don't have to go crazy. And I work on sessions. I, I, I like to work on a small little piece here and there, okay? I'm gonna use this screen over here and then over here. I'm gonna pass it this way. So to me, these are neutral colors. When you have them 
down you know you want to do a little mix of color instead of like using straight from the tube you want to make sure that they are mixed a little bit with all the color yellows and blues and stuff like that so that's just like the primary color but you want to mix them at least that's how it works for me all right and then i'm going to get the black over here and see how when you see my left hand it has less control than my right hand. My right hand is faster and I can make mistakes faster. <laughs> if that makes sense. Okay. Using some white. My white here and my green down here a little bit. All right, that's good. I'm gonna put a little bit over here. All right, so I'm gonna stand back just to see what's happening here. Okay. 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 All right, so let me flip this over. and layers guys as till you get what you like okay the magic about abstract is that you are being free you have that freedom I'm gonna put it in here just because I like the flatness I like the darkness over here I got only some scratches here and there I want to do like a nice yellow. I'm going to come with my palette. I'm going to put it up here. I just apply more white to the squeaker and then I will come from up here all the way down here to the meter and then I'm gonna just fly from here all the way here and then I'm gonna come from this line over here all the way I'm gonna press a little bit so I can leave more of the color and then I'm gonna do the same over here moving around there we go making like a little line over here and then I'm gonna do the same here it's like doing like a chess kind of pattern I come over here yeah, I'm gonna do the same coming down here. So I kind of like the softness of this guy over here. I love this vase very much, so I don't want to move it away. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna switch this all the way now, okay? I'm gonna keep doing what I was doing with my squeaker. I kind of like the vibe of like my canvas already has some texture in it from before that I prep so it has like a lot of structures and shapes here and there and it's pretty pretty cool all right we need to put a little bit more of white over here and then more white here okay and then come with some sweeper I'm gonna spray it a little bit it doesn't get too dry on me and then I'm gonna come and do the same thing over here with my squeaker stop right there lift it I love how it's like getting all the drips here and I'm gonna give you a close-up of that because I think it's pretty cool 
see that what I mean like it's like just wash out and it's pretty cool Alright, I'm making that. I'm gonna use a little bit of this beautiful yellow oxidant. I'm gonna add some to it right here. Can you guys see that? Can you guys see that over here? Yes. Oh, I love to talk to you guys, even though uh, you guys can't talk to me. When I get your comments, it's just like a life changer for me. It just makes me so happy you guys are watching what I'm making. <laughs> It's a, it's a happy heart for a content creator, let me tell you. Okay, I'm gonna put a little bit more of the white over here. Not too much, because I don't want to ruin that beautiful. Maybe come down a little bit here. Now we're gonna flip this, this way, okay? So I'm gonna get my straight up black and I'm gonna put it over here just a little bit just a little. Okay, I'm gonna scratch it a little bit okay I'm gonna do the same over here I don't know if you guys can see that and then I'm going all the way down and all the way down Okay, perfect straight line right here. Up. Nice. Beautiful. All right, so this is the final look. There is only two layers on this painting. It's the perfect painting for any home decoration, any wall colors, any house anywhere i think the neutral color is just very pretty and subtle and this is what it looks like on stage and this is what it looks like thank you so much for watching my videos and liking it and leaving comments you guys are the best and i will see you on the next video